So in this section we are going to discuss about the common threats for the email security. So common threats are the phishing, malware, spam, email spoofing, email bombing, ransomware, VEC, message hijacking and the social engineering. So first we are going to talk about the phishing. Phishing is nothing just a fake website. Just a fake website and looks like the similar as a real website like it may be the bank website it may be the your organization website it may be any other government organization website which will ask you to providing the credential credentials and credentials may be your username and password user and password and sometimes they will ask to provide the information like the credit card detail and some other information. So always be aware to provide the your credential, username, password or other sensitive information over the form, over the website or over the government website. Please check those website properly before entering your credentials. Malware. Malware is a type of the short code. It may be the tool, script or any software which will install on your system and steal your personal information or critical information. Not only this, also damage your, damage your system or the application or any type of the activity to damage your files or it may be the type of the ransom which will encrypt your files and ask for the money or ask for the ransom. So these malware mostly come in the attachment. So when you are using the attachment or downloading the attachment always keep in mind to check the download attachment, downloaded attachment before the processing or open it. Spam is a another type of the attack where the hacker is sending the lots of the emails to you. Related uh, sometime marketing, related sometime lottery, related sometime lots of the spam may be possible. Email spoofing another type of the emails for the example, you have opened the email and you are checking the sender and email look like something else but the sender is a something else. For the example, the email body is looks like it is sended through the or via the LinkedIn or looks like the LinkedIn template asking for the like the page, follow the page or change your password or login on uh, LinkedIn profile, whatever it looks like the LinkedIn. When you are looking over here and you find there is a another website or the email address which is not belongs to the LinkedIn or it is similar as a LinkedIn but not actually the uh, coming from the tech support of the LinkedIn. So it is called email spoofing means when the email is sent to you and it looks like to uh, another organization or trusted organization what but actually this email not belongs to that particular organization. Email bombing is a, another type of the threats where lots of the emails are sent to you know in your inbox. Ransomware is a type of the malware which is going to be installed on your system and encrypt all the files related to PDFs, PDF file, talk text, uh, doc file, Excel file and lots of the files which are related to the uh, relate to your work or relate to your personal information like photos, MP4 and much. All these type of the files which convert into the encrypt or these file is encrypted and they are asking for the money. Once you will send the money, they will send you the key 
to decrypt your files and ransomware is generally sent through the emails so whenever you are downloading the file through the attachment or the link provided inside the email go to that particular website and download the ransomware or the any file on your system it is also maybe the harmful another is a business email compromise so as its name is a business email business email is a type of the emails which are used for the business purpose only for the example is a vijay at the rate cyberpratibha.com or your name your name your name at the rate your organization.com so this is emails are the business email so once the business email are compromised it is called business email compromise for the example the email of the ceo of your organization has been hacked or get compromised by the hacker and they are sending the multiple uh, emails to you and ask to provide some information ask to provide for the money ask to provide the download the file ask to do any type of the task so before doing or completing this task once confirm your upper organization or the upper layer about these emails message hijacking is a type of the attack where hijack the messages and sending unsolicited message to you social engineering is a type of the attack where the hacker is going to be manipulate the human mind and ask to provide the information to the hacker it may be your credential or it may be your sensitive information 